Hi, it's Miss Bryant with your announcements. So we're in November. That happened pretty quickly. And this is the final normal week of November because things get mixy coming up soon. Um, next week, you only have Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Um, Thursday is Veterans Day. Friday's Faculty Academy, which is people free. Um, we're talking next week. The week after that, it is a 1 p.m. dismissal every day. The week after that is Thanksgiving break. Congratulations, we're almost there. And then we're already in December. Here are a couple notes. One is that students do have ARIES access, and this is important for you to note because when you get home after school, you should be checking Google Classroom to see if there's any communication from your teachers, but also check the grade book. That is a completely different system. They're not aligned, um, so it's two different references to check. In your grade book, you'll see missing assignments, and it's important for you to know this because anybody who has a D or F in any class, their parents are receiving an email on Parent Square that um, that you need your D and F addressed. And your parents then might be like heightened and say, what's happening? You have a D and F and you'll be like, I don't know. I've turned in all my assignments on Google Classroom. I don't know what's happening. Check Aries and then go to office hours. Thursday night, this Thursday night, that's tomorrow night, we have a POW night for parents. So if your parents are don't know how to help you with the math POWs, then send them to the POW night. It's Zoom online. Okay, so character conferences are coming up. It's that 1, 1 p.m. dismissal week, November 15th through 19th. And I just want to say one thing for sixth graders. These are 20-minute sessions. It is not talking about, um, uh, uh, uh. It's not talking about your grades. Um, it is talking about what virtue you feel like you've grown in, what virtue you want to grow in. So it is the parents that are there, but the students start the conversation. So we hear from the student first, then the parent, and then the teacher. You sign up with two teachers, only one of them might you have. Um, because it's sort of like a community conference. Um, really cool clubs. we got a couple more clubs on this list, lunch clubs. So it's Wednesday. Yearbook club is during the day on Wednesday. But tomorrow at lunch, you'll see Studio Ghibli, Drawing Club, Friday's Comic Book Club. But a couple new clubs on Monday started the Fidget Toy Club, the Business Club, the Chess Club. Next week almost done. Next week, after school clubs, really cool. Again, there's clubs every single day of the week. Um, thanks to Charlotte for starting the Rubik's Cube Club um, and a couple other really awesome clubs of note. I am really pleased, let me go back to lunch clubs, that I got to go to the LGBTQIA plus club um, on Tuesday at lunch. Ella, thank you so much for making that club. I think that club was a really helpful complement to having a women meeting and a men meeting when we really want to try to be very inclusive and not exclude anyone. So thank you for that club. Thank you for all the really thoughtful students who are attending. Lost and Found note, um, I have over the past couple years gotten a couple cardigans from the Lost and Found that I really like or jackets and it's starting to be jacket season as you can tell. Um, so unless you want to donate your clothes to Miss Bryant or to the school or to local um, donation places, get your stuff out of the lost and found. Um, and that's it for us. Have a really good day. Bye guys. Happy November.